if the vast and powerful forces I had gathered could not perform their sworn duty and protect their own emperor, they did not deserve to lay claim to this galaxy in my absence. For their failures, I would see them burn. And the galaxy along with them. Darth Sidious claiming that Sloane had been captured during the attack on Chandrilla, Gallius Rax seized power as the self-styled counselor to the Empire. When Borum asked why they were traveling to the barren world of Jakku, Rax responded that he wanted to test the metal of his new armada above the planet. In secret, Rax planned to eliminate the other council members with the exception of Brendel Hux as part of the Emperor's posthumous contingency. Unbeknownst to the Empire, its destruction had been planned by the Emperor who did not believe that the Empire should continue after his demise. He also deemed the Empire's downfall as a necessary outcome for the creation of a new order that would rise in its place. Determined to see his plans realized, Sidious entrusted Rax with the task of executing the contingency and ensuring its success. Meanwhile, Sloane joined forces with the former rebel Brenton Law Wexley to hunt down and kill Rax. While Sloane had received information from the bounty hunter Mercurial Swift that he had discovered that Rax had come from Jakku, the two then traveled to the desert planet. After landing, Brenton and Ray visited a bar owned by Corwin Ballast in an attempt to find information about Rax. Ballast yielded no information but the pair soon got their answer when they witnessed Rax's superstar destroyer Ravager exiting hyperspace with his massive Imperial Armada, the Emperor had returned home. 